Okay, so what we're looking for here <clears throat> is what is the whole unit in each scenario. So let's take a look at the first problem. It says 15 is what percent of 90? 15 is the part, what's the whole? 90. And let's think about how we would use that information to set up a proportion. Do we know what the percent is? No. That's what the question is here. So we would put x over 100 because we know whatever the percent is, it's part of 100. And it's equal to 15 over 90 because 15 is the part and 90 is the whole. Let's take a look at the second one. What number is 10% of 56? What's the whole in this case? The 56. Can we set up the proportion for that one? The first ratio would be 10 over 100 for the percent side. We're looking for the number that's the part, but we know that the whole is 56. Ninety percent of a number is one eighty. What's the whole here? We don't know. This one's a question mark. All we know is that it's a number. Can we find out what it is? We can. We know that the first ratio would be ninety over one hundred is equal to. 180 because the problem says 90% of a number is 180 so the 90% goes with the 180 and this time our x would go on the whole because we don't know what the whole is. A bag of candy contains 300 pieces and 25% of the pieces in the bag are red. What's our whole? 300. Seventy percent of the students earn an eight on the test. What's the whole? We do know it's a hundred percent, but what the exact number is, we don't know. We know that a hundred percent would be the whole class. We know we have seventy over one hundred. I guess in this case we could say that it's 100%, but oh, it's a B, not an 8. 70% of the students earned a B on the test. We're not even told how many of those students we have, so we can't even finish making our proportion. But we do know that the whole class would be 100%. We just have no idea what that number is. Okay, and the last one. The 20 girls in the class represented 55% of the students in the class. Okay, so now we know 55% is the 20 girls. Do we know how many total are in the class? No. Now we have to set up a proportion to find the whole. Hey, I would like you guys to take a few minutes working um, with people at your table to complete this. What's the part, what's the percent, and what's the whole? And if we don't know one of those, you can use a question mark or the variable x, okay?